Hey, let's talk about what happens when you have finished this assignment, the periodic table of the elements coloring assignment. Now, obviously, this is not done, but when it is done, here's what you're going to need to do. You're going to need to get this into your notebook. So the way you're going to do that is you're going to go not here, but over here on the side and either control C or copy the entire slide from this preview area. And then you go to your digital notebook and, you know, find the first available page. And I'll find like, here we go. This is an example. This is like the starting bare bones notebook. Um, your previous, your last page that you used may have some stuff on it. So what you do is you insert, break, and that skips the rest of that page and gets you to the next page. And then once you have found the page you're going to put it on, you paste it in. I just press control V. You could also right click and paste. Either way, you uh, paste unlinked and it turns it into a picture. If you want to change this, it's too late for this. You have to go back to the original one, change this, copy again, and paste again if you were to decide you wanted to change it. I can, it's selected, I can press the left arrow to get out, and maybe press the enter key a couple of times, move it down if I so desire. But that's how you get it in, and of course once it's in, don't forget to go back up to your table of contents and update your table of contents to put it in there and show what page it's actually in making sure the order of things here matches the order of things you actually have in your notebook. And once you've done that, you should be good to go.